What is up, Drop Alert Nation? I'm your host, Keller Keemstar. Let's get right into the news. Now, you're probably wondering why I haven't uploaded in four days. It's because I was at PAX over the weekend, and I've seen so many of you guys there. It was actually incredible how many people showed up. Summer camp! Summer camp! Summer camp! To the fan meetup, and I just want to say... It was so great meeting all of you guys, and you've really motivated me to make more videos. So let's get right into it. Today, a video was uploaded by Tubler Bro, titled Point Blank Robbery Prank, where apparently breaking into someone's home and robbing them at gunpoint is now a prank. Who knows, it's probably fake. But what's even more disturbing is over the weekend, PewDiePie posted this on his Tumblr. Fans that I don't want. I recently shared a sweet post from a mother of a fan who got to meet me through Make-A-Wish Foundation. Make-A-Wish Foundation is a wonderful charity. I've done a few of these before, but I never share them because I don't want people to think I just do it for attention. I thought I'd share the post on my Facebook because it was very sweet. And since I didn't write the post or take any of the pictures, I thought it'd be okay. Here's the picture of PewDiePie and the young girl through the Make-A-Wish Foundation. And then PewDiePie went on to say this. I'm just really fucking disappointed to see some of my fans commenting on this post making fun of a clearly disabled fan, drawing resemblance to a horse, etc. It frustrates the hell out of me because it's not my post, so I can't delete these stupid, horrible, idiotic comments. I just want to say I don't approve of this for a second. I've blocked these people, including everyone who liked their post. I don't want anything to do with fans like this. Man, that's just, that's just really shitty. Also in the news, Twitch streamer known as Grousegore, who recently got banned on Twitch permanently, uploaded a video titled, My Last and Final Words. Now, if you remember a few drum alerts ago, we reported that Grousegore actually accused a League of Legends commentator of sleeping with a 15-year-old girl. Now, apparently, these rumors were false, and that's why he was permanently banned from Twitch. In this video titled, My Last Final Words, he explains that he made the whole thing up, and that he's sorry, and nothing can be done, and he is going to be permanently banned on Twitch forever. But fans of Grosscore are fighting back with a petition to get him unbanned on Twitch. That's right, so far, the petition has 41 thousand signatures to get him unbanned also in the news another twitch streamer is currently banned for well a vag slip that's right we're talking about legendary leah last night apparently she stood up and showed her kuka Twitch has banned her for 30 days. She responded on Twitter by saying this. For the record, thighs equal vag. Sorry, I had to stand in an awkward way due to my ankle injury. Boy shorts were underneath. Calm down. And for the record, we've reviewed the vag slip many times, many, many times for educational purposes. And we've concluded that a vag did appear in the recorded video. And now for our final story, Forbes got it all fucking wrong. Over the weekend, Forbes tweeted out, after a decade of being a staple in gaming, Sony has ended the production of the Xbox 360. Forbes has since deleted the tweet and put it out the correct way. The Xbox 360's production line has ended. All right, guys, that's it for the news today. Guys, I missed you. I'm so glad I'm back. Oh, real quick, I want to talk to you about my keyboard sponsor, Azolt. If you guys are looking for a good keyboard, the link is in the description. Buy it on Amazon. Use code Keemstar. Save yourself some money. Guys, if you love Drum Alert, make sure you slap a like on it. Let's shoot for five likes. Drum Alert Nation now over 1,450,000. Subscribers! That badge slip, though.